are still in port. See the allure of the seas over there. This is the back pool and it's an adult only pool. And then you have Celebrity Silhouette over there and another Holland America. So we're making our way to our room. We can find it here. Should be all the way towards the back. So it should be right here. Okay, this is our cabin. God, look how narrow this is. Okay, so here was the door we came in. I'm gonna have to spin around here. And on this ship, on Holland America, you can see they have bathtubs in the veranda rooms or balcony room, however you'd like to say. So that's what the shower looks like. Pretty big bathroom compared to most ships, which is actually really nice. yeah good size and then swinging around this is the closet let me open it here so robes life vest and then I think there's another one here yeah the bathroom's nice and big yeah, I just don't like the closet right here because then you're always yeah in the room with the yeah another large closet here and this one has double doors. Okay, here's where the safe is. I say usually they have some um, things to, like a shelf. So this is where the shelf and hangers. Okay, so here was the closet just to tell you where we're at. Here's the bed. Nice big mirror there. Couch. Kind of the standard, but. TV, and the door leading out to the balcony. Uh, they have nice chairs on the balcony here. So that is what the room looks like. Here's the main dining room. They have it all decorated for Christmas. This is the first day, so I thought I would show you while it's not busy. It's just kind of a a little overview this is on the top level okay so we are leaving port that is a princess ship over there and if you've left out of Fort Lauderdale then this is very familiar it's a nice sunny day there's not many people out this is one of the pools and it retracts so that's what you're seeing here hello 
That would be cool, like right in there, like eating. What is that? Is that the, that's the pinnacle. So we are in Grand Turk. Look how blue the water is. I hope it's showing up. It's so pretty. And we'll be getting off the ship down here. Basically, they have like a little beach and everything right here. No, there's nobody here yet. It's so early. <laughs> so you can see the ship a little bit. I don't know if anybody else is even going to be in here. It'd only be carnival ships, if so. Yeah. Here is the nice big pool. Of course, it's empty because it's eight o'clock in the morning, nine o'clock in the morning, outside of Jimmy Buffett's. At least I think that's what I read is that he was landed right off the coast, right? All oh, the space shuttle stuff. <laughs> it seems like so long ago now, doesn't oh, no, it? No, no. Yeah. Don't we have a picture standing like in uh -huh. front of yep. when it's up like that? Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, there's a little John Glenn. <laughs> yeah. I read I'm pretty sure that's what I read yeah. is that he... It splashed down here. Pl splash down here, right. So this is supposed to be him. <laughs> Oh, they have a little... Oh, the Cocoa Beach oh, Parade. How funny. Isn't it funny to see stuff like where you lived for so long? Oh, this Kennedy and John Glenn. Okay. I still can't believe people went into space in these things. They're small. I know. Crazy. What's the last time? Was this the last time he went into space? Yeah, he was the oldest guy to ever go. Yeah, because we. So yeah, 1998. I was gonna say that seems like it wasn't that long ago, but I guess it was. <laughs> we were together then, because yeah. I remember when. Huh. So, and how many? He does he have the record of how many times? 
No, I think he's the youngest, or at least the first and the oldest. Oh, okay. I didn't know if he'd been more times than anybody else. Oh, look. It's cool that they have like a little tribute to space and to him here. Sometimes it seems like another lifetime ago that we lived there and... Yeah, that's cool. I mean, it actually gives quite a bit of information, doesn't it? Kind of a little time capsule thing, like from here to shuttle. Mm -hmm. and So this is where we're going to be camped out here. And this is going to be our view. day here at the pool. to one side. That looks like an older carnival ship. Disney. We've only been here one other time, but I don't remember much about it. I don't remember which dock we were at. That flag that you see, there's the Puerto Rican flag. And that building is called the Ateneo Puerto Riqueño. Okay, at that building, they only allow the Puerto Rican flag because it's about the culture and history of Puerto Rico. Okay? Every other place you visit, you will see both flags. American flag and Puerto Rican, the old Spanish military flag. Okay, here to your left hand side, we can see to the right, as I say, is the president's walkway, and here you will see the statues of all those people. And third, we have tourism, okay, within around 7%. So thank you. Okay. So to your right hand side, you can see that beautiful building down there that the roof looks like a white oh, wave yeah. with all the glass. So we are on top of the fort, looking out over the cruise ships there. Did someone say there's iguanas up here? I saw that one in the yard just walking around like a dog. <laughs> so this is the other side of the castle from when we came in. We just walked up this. I don't know if you tell how steep it is, but we are out of breath. <laughs> so that way maybe if I pan around, gosh, it's so pretty. I love the grass. Like it's just so green with the water. And you see the mountains there. It's a little hazy though. You can barely see the tops of the cruise ships. We 
are back from our tour on ship, had a snack, and we're watching the Disney ship leave. We missed the carnival ship leaving. Well, we didn't miss it. I missed filming it. It's <laughs> not Sometimes it moves so slow, like I have to just sit here or you would never see it. Hi, people. <laughs> They're waving at us. We're waving at them. <laughs> Good morning. We are pulling into St. Thomas today. Start to see it a little bit there. Sunrise. Very calm water. Raining out there a little bit. Temperature feels really nice. some of the little shops right outside where we docked. Everything's decorated for Christmas. Over there you get on a taxi to take you in town. It's a little cloudy right now so we're going back. We gotta be back soon anyway. It's a lot. Now what what it was the name of this Crown Bay? Right? Yes. Okay, Ground Bay. We're the only ones in port today at all. There's the ship. So we are leaving St. Thomas. Look how calm the water is. And the pilot is uh, down there. If you ever been on a cruise, you know the pilot takes you in and takes you out. So he's getting close to the ship. I don't know if you guys have ever seen this, so I thought I would show you. I don't know if I can really, but he literally is on the ship and he just got on the boat. He like is on the ship till we leave and then now he's leaving. So the pilot actually comes aboard, coming in and out of port. Anyway, I just thought that would be kind of cool. And they're waving at us. Bye. Thank you. <laughs> I just can't get over how calm the water is. I mean, yeah, he is. Crazy little zodiac. Oh, he is. I don't. You guys probably can't see. There's a little zodiac. I don't know where he's going. See? Oh my gosh. I mean, look at him. He's like a little speck. That's like a bright right there. I know it's not very big, so I don't know where he's headed, but it's crazy. Kind of cloudy, but sometimes that makes good sunsets. But yeah, I mean, so calm. I think this whole area, because when we pulled in, it was extremely calm as well. Because I've never seen a frog tail animal on all of our cruises. Dogs, elephants, birds, you name it. Never monkey. seen a frog. Yeah, monkey. That's a pretty good frog too, I have to say. Good morning. We have a day at sea. Only a couple days left. The sunrise is back that way. Don't want to blind you. Kind of windy out here. Feels nice temperature wise. And then tomorrow we'll be at the private island, which is our last night. So this is pretty much going to be our view all day. But this is why we cruise.
you've ever been on Holland, Princess, or Carnival, then you've been there. That's their private island. I thought I would show you the sunrise. Very pretty. It's about a little after seven, probably. And we're headed towards it this way. I want to hear the rooster again. It's not. You can't come to a private island without hearing the rooster. The water's beautiful. I can't get over how blue it is. It's really clear too, just mm -hmm. like Very the Grand clear. Turk. Yeah. Everybody's gonna be in my video here, whether they <laughs> whether they like it or not. <laughs> Can you sign this, please? The sand's cold, so I'm thinking the water is going to be cold, and it is. 